autopsy reports can vary depending on the circumstance. According to the small knowledge I have uh, on autopsy done on a body uh, in a case of suicide and suicide in terms of hanging themselves, I know there are four examinations that are done. One is external examination, internal examination, and uh, neck examination and toxicology exam report. In toxicology, maybe somebody is asking themselves what is the toxicology examination. Toxicology examination is where the body is tested if there was influence of drug or alcohol in the system. In this case, the victim has to be tested if they had drugs in their system and couldn't defend themselves if for real this person had hanged themselves. Still, he's not free. The circumstantial evidence is what will set him free completely. In this case, he's not still free because we have a lot of questions to ask ourselves. Why did the DCI allow this person to, to, to remove the, the, the evidence, the, the, the bed sheet with bare hands? They couldn't choose a, a, a glove on, his, on their hands because it's so weird. That's tampering with evidence. That is one. Secondly, we ask ourselves, did this Deshaun remove the body alone because Pastor Elizabeth seems to be heavy? How could he carry a, a dead body all by himself? From the hanging sheets. Secondly, why was the why was the the wardrobe not disarranged? If she hung truly hanged herself there, on sober mind that she was committing suicide, she could have felt that because when you when you strangling yourself, you have to feel the pain of strangle or maybe try to move yourself. And I believe somebody hangs themselves where they cannot even support themselves afterwards. Because in the wardrobe, you can hold yourself on the wardrobe when you feel the pain and don't even commit the suicide. Did she have to come from all the way from Nakuru to Nairobi to come and commit suicide in your house, Dishon? This, hey, Kenya, it is becoming too much. It is becoming too much. And uh, these murderers don't even have a good self-defense mechanism or the knowledge to give us and feed us a very nice uh defense system on why and how these people come and commit suicide in your homes otherwise from now we don't need people to come at our places anymore because if a person comes at your place and commits suicide it's weird it's totally weird we're still here crying for 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 the blood that have the graves are crying for innocent blood and we just say all we can say is uh Rest in peace, Pastor, uh, Pastor Elizabeth. And justice for Jeff, as usual, DJ Fatso. Women, listen to me. Now, itabidi munisikilize ama nikasirike. Listen to me. If a relationship cannot work, if it doesn't work, leave it alone. You walk out. Walk out. Walk out. Don't force yourself on someone. You are valuable. You are a queen. You are precious. If somebody cannot see the queen in you, can you walk out? Number two, if a relationship or a marriage is full of violence, when violence walks in, you walk out. Walk out. Go away. Can you run? If somebody tells you, you know one day I will kill you. You know one day I will, I will break your neck. You, you know one day I will remove those teeth. Can you run with your feet? Run away. Number three, don't think that you can ever change a man. If the mother, if the mother cannot change that man, you think you are the one that can change that man. The mother has carried that man for nine months. He has raised that man from when he was a toddler. He has stayed the longest with the mother, even than you, you are the new in a relationship. And then you think you can change that man. No. If you there is something that you are seeing as a red flag and you are seeing this you cannot handle, run. Stop saying you are seeing a red flag. And you know, I will change him. I will, who are you to change him? No, you are valuable. Treat yourself like a queen. Treat yourself like a queen. Let me tell you. And even those who that are in marriage and relationship, it is better to be called a divorcee 
than to, to we come and cry on your burial. After we cry on your burial, we will land at Kikope. We will land at Makutano. We will eat meat and forget about you. Let me tell you, better you have a divorce letter than a death certificate. Better to be called a person that separated than a person that has been in Kenyatta High CU that is injured. Are you listening to me? Are you listening to me, ladies? E. Muskize vizuri. If he cannot work, wachana nayo. I'm not advocating for ladies to remain single. Listen, no. <laughs> there is a man outside there that will treat you like the queen that you are. That is waiting just for you like this. To put an end to your days of sorrows, your days of tears. A God-ordained person for you that will treat you with the respect, with the love that you deserve. So, ladies, wake up. Wake up. Stay woke. If you cannot work, walk out. There is somebody there that is waiting for you to treat you better the way that you deserve it. Kaimiruge, ena mea kai gana. Ena, how old is he? Nena mea kai gana, Nairobi, na exposure ine. You mean miruge doi? Ate modo wa gekuwa dogo ni komu hutia. You mean me roge doi ati modo wako e ita. Ona adhigari shoka komo luta hari yale. Iti muti nagia kamo kwa hake ya gigo iti nagia na goku. Hakati guona mokwa. Nyo investigation. You mean he is so courageous. Modo e dete modo mwana kuro. Yani mutumia mwana komo lele umwe. Mutumia wana kulute la guwa mwana komo uwa lele mwejaga. Okore iti ita wafo resuka. Omo ekele gari so kyo tido ke drive Oga di vitare, oga di efori di eno Oga di eno, oga di viri police stations E amo iso oga soko ka moto wana mosa Le owe Kwa jora moto wana adhigari karega Wato wana adhigari tarima karega No eliki He dea uga nao committee suicide Na area meha na mati yoe Modo ke committee la suicide Guwaku Dua gino niko hukutia Even a fingerprint Da gino niko weneka Kone modo osyo how courageous and how foolish what is this or what is behind this kuita wardrobe in wardrobe modo mugima wena kai gugate wardrobe kuita na suka modo ge Mwedo wake gukana kumuhora. It has a lot of gaps. It has a lot of gaps. And this one is very serious. Gukirona ya DJ Fatso. Because it is very, very, very open. Tadadere. Ugyo ya hati ya mudu akwirile kuwaku. Atena ni kuyoraga. Yani mudo lako hore la guo. Ako lehera adhuti. Asoke yorage. Mudo lako hore la adhuti. Ako lehera ni mudo kwe dete. Oka ni vedo. Asoke yorage. What is not adding up? Ne yoraga ali. E yoraga wabe takumutika. Waba kodhi. Stra. There is a lot of gaps. And I guess that is why statement ya bere DCI maradhi de marame yo vashado maramo to warao akadike ege kasarani. I think the devil is in a lose. Deshi ya jaitani hile ni mwana kereriye. But also nene gweda mudoku na vidye no agihota o korona o hata o kinyela bishop harrison nganga wa cff o moti di kere video ino he prophesied ate gainia mwela gainia ramo mwela celebrities he is a prophet he is a spiritual father in this nation ilu tomu tomu wele atelele kana tomu wele atelele as a spiritual father he stand at the gap ato ho wele to tiro oe ni o that some lives will be lost. Nito yugu ile prophecy. 
no tutiro ina jire no tureciria jari ngi ni celebrate athi anyu joy anyitu kana celebrate athi kwa mutumia bene anyitu fever yathire adu mamurege but if lives will be uh going away to ko ya vava lo ga mathenya ni tondu we ngai areli to hoere hoera ai ni othe to ni lo none kamuguucio the 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 arrow of god in full wrath is in rules na we get you the wider story ya wini to of course ni kuma celebrities mari baba to hoere ini dali yako mudo kwa dakodwira sira ni adwira mudo kwa dakonuma numa jamuri ona ya mudraje tire ngui no dana njira tire ngui ya mudhemba uriku ni ndenda akomenya ni iriku twalithie Thank you.